the first part of it is getting you inside the door in the film industry, doing these assistant jobs, director, producer, production, writer, assistant jobs. That's the first part of the program. By the way, film school and acting school doesn't even get you that. That's why there's so many people that are restaurant managers and working for the government that have film degrees. So many people, it's the majority, okay? So that is huge. Just getting in the door working these paid jobs is huge. The second part is using these paid jobs in the production tornado to now move into these jobs. Because you're there all the time getting these paid production jobs and then you use these jobs to get you into this world. Because you cannot go straight into this world because everybody hires within. Does that make sense? All happens within eight months, super fast. So since it's so fast, you're gonna have to really implement and pay attention to this training because you can move too fast. That's why you must have this team, the 50-50-20 is very important because you gotta have a team of people to keep you safe to keep yourself safe. And you're also gonna need 50 people who hire you to get you into these jobs, 50 people who refer you to get in these jobs, and 20 people who are your team. Okay, got it all covered. We got it all covered, you will not make any major mistakes. You'll be all using your time doing exactly what you should be doing to get into this business. We, you sign up, you join us, you get going with everybody that signed up and joined us, joined us, and we're together and we go. And we are a group. So, yeah, uh, IOUs, that's not uh, what we do here. No. And what you learn by getting it together makes me know that you're going to be successful in the film industry. Because people that like exchange or whatever, don't have any money, they never have any money. They're, that's practices of no money. It's so clear to, to see, uh, and I, so it's clear for me to see. It's hard for other people to see because they're like, well, that's a situation you don't realize. I've got this expense and this one, and, but they're, it's, if they really were honest, there's a reason why, because other people have money and they don't. Why, why, why? It's choices. Um, so, you know, working constantly, you're not going to, there's no way you're not going to have money. I have somebody that's in this program right now, and he's got this kind of um, real protective aura around him. Like he's been hurt because he's been, he's experienced racism. He's been hurt. He's kind of acts like a kind of, you know, strong guy. Yeah, cool dude. Yeah, no problem. Uh, and I'm telling him, dude, you are going to have to, first of all, really know that you've got a lot of growth here because you've got to lose that cool, protective uh, vibe about you that you're using because you've been hurt. A lot, of, a lot of us have been hurt, and we put this on. But you have to lose it because the more you protect yourself from other people, you don't make relationships. The film industry is all about relationships. So I'm like, well, you're going to have to start to shift to... Hey, how's it going? Great to meet you. Oh my God, I'm so excited to be here. And, and it can feel like that's not my personality, but it's a part of everybody's personality. There's a part of you that will be able to relate and get out of your own head and be with people. He is working three jobs right now, security at a tire store and somewhere else. He's working all the time to pay for this program, to pay for his life, and he also borrowed money to do this program as well, right? So he's got to pay back the person. He's working all the time. And uh, my opinion is that there's no freaking way he's not going to have an amazing career in the film industry because look how determined he is. Look what he's already doing. He's working his ass off. So he's going to get it. And it may take him a little longer and he has a lot of growth to do, but he's going to be in the film industry. Oh, but I can't do that because I don't have any money now. Go get a job, two jobs, get catering work, get babysitting work, sell some stuff. Uh, actually, email me for the list of stuff that people do to pay for this program. I've got a whole page I can send you, tons of ideas. Uh, Roland, the pharmacist, when he went freelance, he did promotional modeling, and he also set up um, uh, photo booths. It took him four hours. He made 300 bucks, 300 bucks a day, 
setting up photo booths. 